long for you. Could you just tell me how many digits it is? Ah. So that I can sort of program my mind, you see? How Two. many digits by how many digits? They're both eight digits. Eight digit numbers? Yes. Okay, fine. I'll look at it once it is written down. Okay, now, <coughs> the question is 2, 4, 5, 9, 3, 7, 2, 8, multiplied by 3, 8, 7, 2, 2, 1, 3, 6. Now, tell me, Ayas, you want me to give you the answer from this side to this side or this side to this side? Oh, my <laughs> God. <laughs> I don't think I want the answer. <laughs> what a choice. Okay, go, tell me, go backwards. On. I think let Chandrasekhar decide. Chandrasekhar, do you want the answer from this side to this side or this side to this side? No, we'll keep the uh, unconventional method later on. Let's uh -huh. go the conventional route first. This way, you mean? Yeah, we have enough problem digesting the whole <laughs> multiplication. No, no, itself. this way? Yeah. This way? Uh, why don't we do it differently? What about, what about the panel? Would you prefer the other way? No, we, we should start from the left. From oh, this way, yes. left, right? Yes. Okay. okay, I got right. the answer already. The answer is 9, 5, 2, 3, 2, 1, um, uh, 6, 8, 0, 3, 6, 3, 0, 0, 8. <laughs> I, I, I wouldn't believe if that was is right. Is it correct? That's <laughs> exactly correct. Absolutely right correct? Yeah. Thank right you. Right on the pen. I, I, geez, I, I can't believe that. Are you sure it's even one digit is not wrong there? It's mm -hmm. perfectly correct. 12. I fjerde 1969. Uh, and multiply this with my birthday. Dag og fødselsår, så må vi til det også. Mine i 18, 17, 20, 18. Vi vil try. 1204169 multiplied by 1008192. Her is the answer. 1, 2, 1, 4, 0, 6, 2, 6, 4, 4, Three, six, two, three, two. That's that's my answer. What yes. does the five set have to say? It, it's the same. Answer. It's correct. Yes. Thank you very yes. much. This was a great thing. I could not say it. Do it. Twelve in fjerde 1969. Uh, og multiplisere det med min fødselsdag og uh, fødselsår, så må vi til det også. Mine i 18, 17, 20, 18. Vi vil try. 1204169 multiplied by 1008192. Here is the answer. 1, 2, 1, 4, 0, 6, 2, 6, 4, 4, 3, 6, 2, 3, 2. That's, that's my answer. What yes. does the five set have to say? It, it's the same. Answer. It's correct? Yes. Thank you very much. This was a nice thing. I could have said it. I could have said it. Mathematics has been disliked by many ever since numbers have been discovered. But one woman aims to change this perspective. 69-year-old Shakuntala Devi inspires young minds to love numbers. A mathematical genius, she is known for super-fast calculating skills. I'm always happy to be in new countries, meeting new people doing this work and spread, spreading the perfume of mathematics. The 30th of April 2008, Manipal University in Dubai was honored by a visit by this prodigal personality.
On her visit, Shakuntala Devi held an interactive session for the students and faculty. I'm very happy to be here. How many of you love mathematics here? One more to rest with you. Okay. Well, at least it is better than one of my recent experiences. I was performing in a school in New Jersey, high school. There were over 2,000 students. And I asked this very same question. Only one hand went up, and that was the hand of the maths teacher. <laughs> The session began with Chakuntala Devi effortlessly solving cube roots for the numbers given by the students. You know, the question here, 190109 Answer is 575, right? Channel's number is 180867, correct channel? The answer is 123. 1, 2, 3, just a moment before you clap. 1, 2, 3 multiplied by 1, 2, 3 is equal to 1, 5, 1, 2, 9. Am I correct? 1, 5, 1, 2, 9 multiplied by 1, 2, 3. Here this is at 1, 8, 6, 0, 8, 6. Is that correct? Thank you, Shabbat. Sina Pitu, right? Your name. One seven six five five eight four eight one. Yeah, it's good. 561, right? Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Puja Dilip. Puja. Where are you? Where are you from, Puja? There's a very valid reason why I'm not lost to. Tell me why. You are from where? Gujarat. Because the number she has given me 46909744. The answer is a very famous bottle of pickles that is sold in the South. Answer is 777. Once she had the audience spell bound, she proceeded to her famous calendar trick. Okay, everybody. Now, this calendar contains all the months beginning from January to December. Am I correct? I don't need the year because it's 2008, right? I don't want the month, I don't want the date. Only thing I need is the day of the week. Like Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Taking the day, I'll be able to decide very quickly all the days and the date each month this year. Dr. Ramji, a day. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Wednesday. All the Wednesdays. You must flip the calendar. All the Wednesdays, January to December. January, Wednesday, 2nd and 16th, 23rd, February, 6th, 13th, 28th, 27th. In March, 5 till 1926, April 2nd and 16th, 23rd, 30th. May 7, 14th, 21st, 28th. June 4, 11, 18, 24. July 2nd and 16th, 23rd, 30th. August 6, 13th, 28th, 27th. September 3, 10, 17, 24. October 14, 15, 27, 29. November 5, 12, 1926. December 3, 10, 17, 24. Moving on, she showed the audience a magic square trick. I constructed a magic square in such a way that whether it is added left to right, right to left, upside down, downside up, or diagonally, it will be the same total. how all the rows and columns really did add up to 30. 30. This is <laughs> it wasn't only her numerical feats that left the audience in a daze, she even had them in splits with her spontaneous sense of humor. The other day I did a show on 101 point something, I don't remember the name of the name of the 101.6 and there was a very charming and a wonderful presenter, Kritika. She, before I went on the radio, 
She called for some people to phone and tell her why do they hate maths. And one man was very, very aggressive. She said, I hate math from the bottom of my heart. Did anybody hear that? Yeah, he yeah, said, yeah, yeah. when I want to abuse somebody, I don't use four letter words or anything. I just call him, you binomial care. <laughs> All in all, the interactive session had many in awe of her abilities, as was obvious from the reactions. It was awesome, uh, it was quite uh, uplifting and uh, it was informative, great personality, it's lovely to see you. I never liked maths in school and even in college I never took maths as a subject. But after this interactive session with Chakuntala Devi, my perspective towards maths has changed. She was, she was amazing, extremely fast and I was so not expecting that and I had an amazing life. Definitely it has aroused my interest in mathematics again. I'm really looking forward to uh, going through and referring through her books. After the session, Chakuntala Devi sat down with a student to talk about her passion for spreading a love for the subject. take your numbers to be? Is it a personality? Is that how you remember your numbers? Numbers are lives according to me. They are not symbols on the paper. I look at them as beautiful numbers. So has this, is this something that is inborn or does it have to be learned over a period of time? Well, in my case, I was born with numbers, you know, so, but I am also trying to pass it on to people. I would like to spread it around. That's what I meant so by it can be learned. yes. Learned means it depends on to what extent you practice and take interest. Uh, in this age, where everyone is so dependent on computers for all their activities, it's a pity. It's really a pity because oh. you must depend on yourself. You know, I'm one of those people who preach believe in yourself. You follow me? At least I believe in myself. And you should be capable of doing anything at any time. You know, being completely dependent on computers. Now, for example, you have an electronic diary, you store numbers, names, and phone numbers, and everything. One day you lose the diary, what happens? You're, <laughs> you're, you're, in, a, <laughs> you're in a quandary. So, how much uh, technology do you apply in your life? Not much. Not I'm one of those people who shun technology. I believe in the very, very basic. Thing about life. And before she left, she imparted a few valuable tips to the students. Number one tip, the key is to memory, okay? Concentration and focus, same as in mathematics. Number two, build, uh, number two, repeat it mentally at least five times. Number three, most important, not only for memory, for almost everything in life, self-confidence. Yes. Believe in yourself. This is the mantra I am giving all of you. Believe in yourself. Okay? Her visit to Manipal University kindled an interest in numbers among the students. Shakuntala Devi radiates a zeal to change attitudes towards mathematics world over. Because numbers can't be so bad after all.